Good morning, party people! Did that look at all like that was my voice? We totally fooled them. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to another <laughs> reaction <laughs> video, guys. We're running out of ideas to keep them entertained. <laughs> we'll come up with new stuff. <laughs> hey, today we are checking out a heavy band. Uh, this is the new single by Like Moths to Flames. The song is Habitual Decline. Yeah, I'm not like, I'm not super familiar with them. Heard like plenty of their songs on playlists and things yep. like that. Um, maybe this will convince me to give them more of a go. I saw them a few years ago uh, supporting August Burns Red and they were very fun. So I'm excited for this. Right. JBL on. Let's have fun. A three, a two, a one. Ooh. well transitioned from heavy to aggressive clean vocals. Yeah, well like, cause I'd said I'd heard a few of their songs before, I didn't know if it was the- um, Same guy. Same guy, yeah. the screamer vocalist, like clean singer as well. That's cool, I like that. Always got heaps of respect for dudes that can do both and do it well. So uh, Also, I'm curious what these mask things are, cause they're creepy. Yeah, they are creepy. Your favorite thing. I love creepy. <laughs> Cool little guitar work there. Yeah, I like the cool little backing um, guitars. Is that two guitarists or just one? Because I'm I not think sure. It's two. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I dig that. The song was sick. Yeah. Um, I don't really know what's going on in the film clip. I no, the film clip was a little bit sort of abstract, wasn't it? <laughs> cool, uh, like I, was, I really liked the, the, the lighting and it was- The colour scheme was cool. Um, yeah, it was a, like a, a strong, but the, the song was sick. That their was, performance, like part of the video was cool. He was very um, like believable, like you could see like him emitting a lot of emotion and yeah, stuff 100%. like that. So he obviously gives a shit about what he's singing about. Um, I thought he did a really good job there, as I said before, the transition between his heavy, heavy vocals into the cleaner vocals. Yeah. Um, he still has that aggression there, 
but you really wouldn't know it's necessarily one vocalist. No, 100%. And like I enjoyed in the chorus, there was like when he, like he can get into quite a high register, which is really mm. good for a dude that's got such a big scream. Yeah, and a deep scream as well. For that yeah, episode, yeah. It's like a lot of versatility in his voice. Like, I, like I've said a million times, I love hearing them be able to move the pitch of a scream. I think it, it, it takes a lot of effort to be able to do that. Mm. It's really quite hard to move your voice while putting so much strain on it. Um, but yeah, I really dug it. I thought there was some cool sort of big heavy beat down sections. And which also it's like pretty unique. Like there was that uh, guitar solo. It still had vocals at the top yeah, of it, yeah. but towards the end of it. You don't hear that many guitar solos in metal like that as much. Yeah, not in this sort of metal core and, as, and definitely not in a single. No, um, that's true. It would be more for a track that, you know, is probably a bit of a longer track, but that had that little bit and it was like, it was a real sort of, like a lot of feel in it, a lot mm. of bends and long notes. You can imagine him standing on a mountain with his hair blowing in the wind. His hair was blowing in that whole thing. Oh, man. They must have had a wind machine going on in that. <laughs> oh, I like that. that would, that's going to get angry. Angry? Oh, well, I'm out. <laughs> See you guys later, bye. See ya. Anyway, guys, that's enough from Nathan. He's angry. It's going to get added to my Angry Music for Happy People playlist. Uh, link is down below if you want to check that out. And make sure to hit subscribe, comment what you guys want to see from us next. Give us ideas. Tell us what you're enjoying. Um, we do have something fun. Make sure you leave comments because we've got something fun coming up we in, do have something in fun a few reactions. We're going to really enjoy this. And if you've been a part of this since we started doing it and you've been leaving some comments, maybe stick around and watch because you might... Get a shout out. We love you. We think you're incredible. You're going to do great things. Have fun.